I'm Justin William McMakin. I'm a member of the Profit Leaders, a Goal Achiever Success Team. And I just want to say welcome to the behind the scenes. This is the startup of our first event, Profits Are Better Than Wages. Uh, we look forward to sharing this day with you. It was a mastermind from our mastermind group to come up with this event. And only five weeks after its inception, here it is. We've got about 200 people registered for the event and we've got seven incredible speakers lined up. You're just gonna see a little fast forward probably of people coming in and us getting ready and doing some testing so you can see what happens behind the scenes of a Profit Leaders event. We're gonna be having speakers from all around the world showing up to be on the Profit Leaders events list. We're gonna be doing monthly events, hopefully for years to come. Thanks very much. We look forward to seeing you soon. Again, I'm Justin William McMakin, author of the 30-minute website workbook, 30minutewebsites.com and Full Media Center. When I told you to change only two things, it was easy. And everyone said, oh, yeah, that's easy, that's manageable. So it's the same thing with your savings. You just need to start. But you need to start where you're comfortable and then get uncomfortable. Because in order to grow, you have to become uncomfortable. Next slide, change small and change often. This is how you move your life. It's not about jumping in both feet. It's about testing the water and moving, gradually moving and increasing your understanding. So change small and change often. When you understand the importance of this first key, the habit of saving, and you exercise the discipline and the focus needed, you will end up to be this. Not Bruce Lee. I'm a martial artist, and last August, I did my third degree training. I got my third Dan, but I didn't get there overnight. I changed small, I changed often. I was comfortable, and I got uncomfortable in order to grow. And so it is with you, you must become uncomfortable. So if you exercise the discipline and the focus, Focus firmly on course until successful. You're here this morning because you've been invited by someone that cares about you. And you're here to support others. Focus on the journey. Focus on the goal. If you exercise this discipline, you will avoid the following. Runaway debt. You need to get this in control. This is robbing more and more people of the future they wish than anything else. Overspending living above their means, wanting what the Joneses have, but not understanding what the Joneses have done with their personal development, with their financial literacy, with the connections that they've made because they've developed the skill sets. Wealth doesn't come to you unless you're prepared for it. It's not something that you chase. You become successful by the person you are. And so we want to stay away from this. How many can relate to this picture? Being in debt, 
Not understanding the math. Oh my gosh, how am I going to climb my way out of this mess? I was there once, wondering, month after month, how am I going to get through this? But there are ways to get rid of this. But you have to exercise the discipline. Hello, everybody. Thank you. Keep standing. We're going to network today. All of us here. OK? A business card is you. I have a statement, brand you. OK? So the point with this is communication language. Everyone communicates differently, agreed? Like, I can send a text, or, or sorry, a message to my friend I, and I work out with, he won't respond. But I text him, I get an instant message. Now, especially in business, this is very important. I urge you to pay attention to this. How do we communicate? Because that could help you build a relationship quickly and be more effective long term. Because it's all about relationships, right, ladies and gentlemen? It's about long term relationships. That's the most important thing. I chose. 